Welcome to the Good Morning Show, Friday Life Live, where we strive to start our day in a good way with some joy and some hope and some encouragement as we continue to seek wisdom, truth, and life. My name is Brian Bell. I'm so glad you're here. It is Friday, April 19, 2024, week 16, day number 110 of the new year, live stream number 310. Hey, let's know where we are. Let's know where we're going. Let's know why we're going there. And let's make today count. Good morning, live streamers, Finding Life family, Finding Lifers. So good to see you. So good to be here with you. Happy new day of life. Happy Friday. Let's see who we have with us this morning. First up on my side, we have Debo coming in hot from Florida. Debo, good morning. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Hope you're doing well. Let's see here. Let's see. Deborah's got, it looks like there's a lot of typing here, Deborah. Let's see. It says, Melanie, I'm sorry you're not feeling well. If Lars isn't nice to you, we will make him clean up the chat kitchen. Cat is making a flowery mess there. Cat is Cat and Lars are they uh, are they are they cooking it up this morning? Hey, thank you for the like. I just saw that. Thank you so much. I appreciate it and uh, appreciate all the help and support, the love and support, and I much and much love to all of you as well. Deborah says you guys want to do a bit of praying. I think there has been an attack from the enemy this morning. Of course, yes. Pray without ceasing. Am I right? Let's go. Melanie says, he been, he been scolding for complaining of a lots of things. Oh, no. Not trouble in paradise, please. Melanie, good morning. So good to see you. Thank you for staying up late with us. Happy Friday night to you. It's so good to have you with us this morning. Deborah says, so Father God, here we go. So Father God, according to your desire for Luis, Louise's, is that right? Louise's and all of our lives, I pray that you forgive our sin. I'm sure we have all been guilty at least once of this horrible sin. Oh, like a specific sin, perhaps. Deborah says, yes, she was used by evil. Let's pray for her and bless her according to Jesus who tells us to do so because she is being used by darkness to sow discord. I don't know who you're talking about yet. For anyone anyone that doesn't know, the the pre-show, the pre-show live chat comments come into the streaming software out of order. So it's always a mixed bag. And we all just have to figure it out as we go. Or I do. I guess everyone else already knows what's going on. Deborah says, I asked Father that you would heal Cat's heart. Praying for Cat. Uh, Heal Cat's heart. I asked that you would go into all of our hearts and gather up all the seeds of venom that were placed there by your enemy. Uh, Deborah says, Luis Semper, Ephesians 4, 1 through 3. Oh, that does not make Father God happy when we sow discord. Uh, let's see what this is. Ephesians 4, 1 through 3. Some word from Deborah. Let's go check it out. By the way, yesterday, <clears throat> Dalton Blair was talking about he was, uh, I saw, I uh, didn't have time. We, we ran out of time yesterday, and we got to be we gotta be right on time today. Uh, uh, but yesterday, Dalton Blair was saying he was seeking to live out James 1, 19. And so I pulled it up in the post-processing. It says, My dear brothers and sisters, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. And we're going to read about some anger today in in Proverbs, actually, uh, that will kind of go along with that. Let's go see what Deborah has here in Ephesians 4. Let's go there. Ephesians 4, from Debo. Ephesians 4, unity and maturity in the body of Christ. As a prisoner of the Lord, then, I urge you to live a life worthy of the calling you have received. Amen to that. As a prisoner for the Lord, then, I urge you to live a life, live a life worthy of the calling you have received. May we do that. Be completely humble and gentle. Be patient. Bearing with one another in love. I mean, all we're reading about right now is how much that we should love one another. That's what the current word is, that God is love. And that and if we if we hate if we hate a brother or sister in Christ, which hate is a strong word, but it can be, you know, it's it's it doesn't even it it's not even as strong as hate. If we don't love a brother or sister in Christ, we can't love God, and God can't be in us. That's what we're reading right now. Make every effort to keep the unity of the Spirit through the bond of peace. There is one body, 
and one spirit, just as you were called to one hope when you were called, one Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God and Father of all, who is over all and through all and in all. Amen. Amen, Deb. Hey, thank you for the good word, Deborah. So greatly appreciate it. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on, but maybe uh, we'll find out as we continue forward in today's live chat. Let's continue forward. Melanie says, Shalom, beautiful sister Deborah, sister Sarah, sister Kat, and handsome brother Rick with lots of coffee. Thank you, Melanie, for making us all coffee. Deborah says, I ask that you replace those words in Kat's heart. I ask that you replace those words in Kat's heart and all and in all of our hearts with your words that speak of love and mercy and forgiveness. We bless our enemy, but we never bless Satan. Man, something has happened that I have no idea what. Deborah says, we ask that you judge your enemy who has tried to hurt us that are here, but we ask that you forgive and heal and bless the servant of darkness that he used. Melanie says, excuse me, Lars, with a strong arm. I'm too tired, exhausted, anxiety attack. Yeah, I don't have rights to complain. Be you surrender. Man, I don't know. Uh, better. I don't know what's going on this morning. It's like, what is going on? Deborah says, let your, let the uni- let, let your unity and shalom of your spirit fill our devices and fill our hearts and flow one to another. Amen, Deborah. Melanie says, yeah, you surrender, Lars. Melanie says, all caps, shalom, handsome brother Brian. Thank you, beautiful Melanie. Thank you so much. Shalom to you. Beautiful Miss Bell, Miss Diane, and to everyone I forgot. Sorry. Peace. Got a thumbs down, apparently. Psalm 27, 4. Are we in a battle? Are we in a real life battle this morning? Uh, Melanie says, Psalm 27, 4. 2 Corinthians 4, 16 through 18. Isaiah 41, 10. Proverbs 21, 21. With some prayer, some peace, some love, some coffee. Let's go check it out. Let's go get into some more word. Thank you, Melanie, for bringing us some good word this morning. Let's see what you got. Psalm 27. We'll start there. We'll start there where you started. Psalm 27. Psalm 27, 4 from Melanie. Oh, I guess I could just type it in. Uh, 27. Let's go. Well, we can just scroll down. Let's just click on it, and we can see some different translations here. NIV says, One thing I ask from the Lord, this only do I seek. Let's share it with you. That I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to gaze on the beauty of the Lord and to seek Him in His temple. That I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. Amen. King James says, one thing I have desired of the Lord that I will seek after, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. Let's see what else you got here, Melanie. Amen. 2 Corinthians 4. Second Corinthians 4. 16. 2 Corinthians 4. 16 through 18 from Melanie. Therefore, we do not lose heart. Do not, we do not lose heart, though outwardly we are wasting away, yet inwardly we are being renewed day by day. Today, it is a new day. We are being renewed right now. For our light and momentary troubles are achieving for us an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. Praise God for that. So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. Seen, since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. Amen. Let's go. Got to fix our eyes. Fix our eyes on Christ. Amen. Let's go. Uh, Let's see. What's next? Isaiah 41.10. Isaiah 41.10. One of Shelby's life verses. Growing up through life. Isaiah 41.10. So do not fear. So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand, says God. Do not fear. I am with you. Do not be dismayed. I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Amen. Let's go. Let's go. Praise God. Thank you, Melanie. 
And Proverbs 21, 21, let's go find some life. Let's go find some life. Let's go. That's what we're here to do is find life. Every day, every day. Proverbs 21, 21, whoever pursues righteousness, whoever pursues doing what is right and love, God is love. We're supposed to love God with all our heart, mind, and soul and love others as ourself. Whoever pursues doing the right thing and love finds life. But that's not all. Also, prosperity and honor. What some good bonuses there. Praise God. Amen. Thank you so much, Melanie. Let's pursue righteousness. Let's pursue doing what is right. And let's pursue love. Because love conquers all. Amen. Amen. All right. So good. Thank you so much, Melanie. So greatly appreciate the word. Thank you for bringing that to us this morning. Deborah says, good morning, beloved of Jesus. Cat, where is breakfast? Deborah says, good morning, beloved of Cat, Turtle, Gabriel. What a blessing to have you here this morning. Melanie says, shalom, handsome brother Jerry, brother Gabriel. Deborah says, yes, Cat, that is a good idea. Link our shield of faith together, encourage one another, and even more as we see the day approaching. Amen. Hebrews 10. Deborah says, what, Lars? I thought those signs were suggestions. Ha ha. Okay, what's going on? Deborah says, Lars, you ate it all again. You know where how he is, Cat. Melanie says, Shalom, handsome brother David. Deborah says, Good word, Cat. Deborah says, David Ray, you awake yet? Deborah says, Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. We're going to have some, that's going to come up in today's word too. In today's psalm, that's coming up in today's psalm. Pray for, pray for the peace of Jerusalem. Pray for Israel. Pray for those that stand with Israel. I am appalled at how many do not stand with Israel. Melanie says, hi, my beautiful sisters and handsome brothers. I'll be watching. Still not feeling well. Please, Sister Cat, pull Lars' ear so he won't scold me. <laughs> Deborah says, sneaking over to Lars' fridge. David Ray says, hey, Shalom, our wonderful sister Melanie. Hey, David Ray, coming in hot with some peace and some coffee and a donut. Let's go. Good morning, David Ray. So good to see you, bro. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Happy new day of life. Thank you for all you do. David Ray says, good morning, Friday Life family with some love. I'm here. What are your other two wishes? <laughs> ah, that's what I'm talking about. David Ray says, hey, Deborah, good morning. Sarah says, morning, Kat. Good morning, Mel. Good morning, Sarah. So good to see you, my Tennessee sister. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Happy new day of life. Happy Friday. Jerry says, morning, all. Good morning, Jerry. So good to see you, bro, and have you with us this morning. Hope you're doing well, my neighbor up the coast. Kat says, showtime. <laughs> Hey, we made it to Friday. And, Time keeps on and slipping, we just keep going slipping, round and round and round, don't we? It's Friday. We want the weekend. Who's ready for the weekend? Let's go. Round and round we go. Cat says, sorry, folks. Was busy in the chat kitchen. Here you go. Breakfast burritos for everybody. Wow. Thank you, Cat. Thank you so much, Cat. We so greatly appreciate that. Filling those shoes, filling those big shoes that can't be filled, actually. But, Kat, thank you so much for making us breakfast. We so greatly appreciate it. Jerry said, did we have a troll other than me? Kat says, Deborah, did you eat it all? I set out a whole sheet of burritos. Laura says, strife and division, like that person a few months back, lobotomy survivor. Probably same person, sad experience. Lars, good morning, Lars. Bruh, what's up? Bruh. What's up, bruh? So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Happy Friday. Happy new day of life. Much love to you, bro. Lars, continuing to come in with those new profile pictures. I bow to none other than Jesus Christ, I think it says. Oh, Lord Jesus Christ, I think. Then the Lord Jesus Christ. I I bow to none other than the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, Lars says, I need a refill. Some coffee. Be right back. Lars says, amen, Deborah. Praying for unity and peace. Jerry says, after the lesson, I'm going to have to catch up on Israel-Iran news. Laura says, I think she's gone, Rick. Just entered to be a stumbling block to sow division. <clears throat> I'm still I'm still waiting to find out. Did we have someone Did we have someone throw a bomb in this morning? Laura says, amen, Deborah. Laura says, yummy, I needed that cat. Laura says, I'm always nice. Laura says, I'm always nice. Laura says, good morning, Gabriel, Jerry D, Front of Life family, love you all. Laura says, I hit it in the fridge, cat. Don't complain, submit, Stacy, hi, sis, amen, Deborah, amen, Deborah. Laura says, better surrender. Rick, Fragile Lives, good morning, our northern bros. So good to see you and have you with us. Happy Friday. Happy new day of life. 
Let's see here. Rick says, Louise Simper. I knew some Simpers in Utah. Any relations? Hmm. Is that who it is? Is that the culprit? Cat says, good morning, Friday Life family. Good morning to you, Cat. Sounds like it's not you. I was starting to think it was you, Cat. I'm so glad it's not. <laughs> Cat, good morning. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. You and Turtle, apparently. I haven't seen Turtle yet, but I'm looking forward to it. Hope you're having a good, fun, adventurous morning there on the East Coast. Thank you for the burritos and the sunrise and the sunflower. We so greatly appreciate it. Cass says, don't worry, Debo Ruh. Lars is growing. Lars is a growing boy. Let him eat. I'll just make more. God bless you, Cat. Jerry says, morning, Lars was making coffee. Cass says, good idea, Jerry. We must all keep Israel in our prayers as we go about our lives blessed by peace here. Cass says, remember to link shields today, folks. Link shields. Link shields. Stacy Rose. Hey, Stacy Rose. Guess who's back? So good to see you, Stacy Rose. Again. We've been missing you. So good to see you back. So he says, going to listen while I try to catch a few more Z's. You may be back asleep already. <laughs> but it's so good to see you. Happy New Day of Life. So good to have you with us. Cat says, Proverbs 16, 13 to 19. Let's go check it out. Cat bringing some word. Proverbs 16. We'll go, we'll go tap it in. Proverbs 16, 13 through 19. The word of the Lord. The light to our path through this dark and challenging time on earth. Amen. Cast says, Proverbs 16, 13 through 19, kings take pleasure in honest lips. They value the one who speaks what is right. A king's wrath is a messenger of death, but the wise will appease it. When a king's face brightens, it means life. When a king's face brightens, it means life. His favor is like a rain cloud in spring. How much better to get wisdom than gold? to get insight rather than silver, wisdom and insight, more valuable than gold and silver. The highway of the upright avoids evil. Those who guard their ways preserve their lives. Pride goes before destruction, a haughty spirit before a fall. Better to be lowly in spirit along with the oppressed than to share plunder with the proud. All right. Thank you, Cat, for the good word. Let's go. Thank you so much. We greatly appreciate that, Cat. Can always use some good word. Amen. That's what we're after, wisdom, truth, and life. Rick says, good morning, Jerry. Stacey Rose says, woke up, wanted to pop in, say shalom, and ask God to pour his blessings upon the Finding Life family. Morning in Yeshua's name. Thank you so much, Stacey Rose. Shalom to you, and so good to see you. Happy new day of life. Hope you're doing well. I did, I did respond to your email a while back, just FYI. Rick says it's Friday. It is Friday. It is Friday. I got a new Friday song. We want that weekend. It's Friday. Let's get hyped. It's, 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 it's Friday. Let's go. Let's celebrate. New day of life. Let's go. We got our armor on. The flaming arrows may come at us, but they shall not penetrate. Rick says, good morning, Mel. Sorry you're not feeling well. I am too, Melanie. Rick says, thank you for the coffee, Mel. Rick says, LOL, Lars, I know you are always nice. Rick says, good morning, David. Rick says, in need of a full-time mechanic, to, too much to keep up with. Rick says, yes, David. There's Gabriel. Good morning, everyone. Turtle here, just watching and listening. Hey, Turtle. So good to see you, bro. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Are you off today? Are you off work? Or did you just get home from work? So good to see you and have you with us. Rick says, yes, lots of Discord floating around. Rick says, see that, Lars? Rick says, good morning, Sarah. Deb says, thank you, Kat. I will enjoy my delicious breakfast. Praise God. Rick says, Rick says, showtime. Let's go. It's showtime. It is, it is. David Ray says, Amir has a great video on YouTube about the strike in Iran. Kat says, haha, Deb, I see you. I'm so glad Deb and Kat are, I, when I first came in, I thought you guys were having some issues. I'm so glad to see that. Hopefully that was uh, a misperception. Jerry says, Deborah, God said the world would turn on Israel. Stacy Rose says, blessings, Lars. David Ray says, good morning, Stacy. Dalton Blair says, good morning. Good morning, Dalton Blair. So good to see you, bro. So what an honor to have you with us. What a blessing. Thank you for being here. Yes, Dalton Blair was saying yesterday how he was striving to live out James 119. Let's go look at it again. James 119. My dear brothers and sisters, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen. God says in Isaiah 55, 3, come to me with your ears wide open. Listen, and you will find life. 
listen, and you will find life. James 1.19 says, my dear brothers and sisters, take note that everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. How we should live, amen? The word of the Lord, amen. Dalton Blair, that's a good goal, bro, and we support you. Hey, so good to have you with us, Dalton. Happy new day of life. We're so glad you're here. Rick says, good morning, Dalton. Deborah says, David Ray, he sure does. I'm amazed at how many people in various chat groups I am in are attacking Amir as a deceptive person. I don't know him. Kat says, don't worry, David. I didn't forget you. Here's some coffee. Thank you, Kat. Kat serving us up well this morning with some coffee and some breakfast burritos. Thank you, Kat. Being a servant of the Lord, the hands and the feet of Jesus. God bless you. Stacey Rose says, good morning, David Ray. Dr. David Ray. Dave Ray says, good morning, Dalton Blair. Deborah says, yes, Jerry D., and it's happening. Lars says, Dalton, so good to see you, bro. David, I have two wishes. Give them to Melanie. Melanie might take you out, bro, from the sounds of it this morning. <laughs> Deborah says, there is no other way to come in from Florida but hot. Oh, Dev. Dev. Coming in hot. Dev coming in hot. No other way when you come in from Florida, she says. Let's go, Dev. David Ray says, good morning, Kat. Kat says, hi, Sarah, Stacy, Melanie, Bobby, Deb. Debo. Debo. Here's another one for Debo. Well, if I can find it, Debo. And she's from Florida, so she's not afraid of death or whatever. <laughs> Let's get these going. <laughs> Stacy Rose giving some coffee and donuts and peace. Let's go. Stacy Rose says, Kat, meow. <laughs> Kat says, good morning, Dalton Blair. With a frog. With a frog. Stacy says, love you guys. We love you too, Stacy Rose. So good to see you and have you back with us. Hope you're doing well. David Ray says, good morning, Lars. Jerry D says, here and still don't know what's going on. Me neither, Jerry, but it's okay. I don't mind. Sometimes it's best to just keep, just keep our blinders on and eyes on Christ, right? Let's just keep our eyes on Christ. We don't need to know all the, we don't need to know all the stuff that's going on in the wings Stacy Rose says, good morning, Brian, Bobby, Mama Bell, and the rest of the Bells. Thank you, Stacy Rose. Good morning to you. My beautiful mom in Tennessee says, good morning, everyone, with some love and some prayer and some joy. Good morning, mom. So good to see you and have you with us. Happy New Day of Life. So good to have you with us. We're so thankful that you can join in and interact with us. David Ray says, hey, good morning, Jerry. Laura says, Jerry, it was among the very first chats, just a misguided sheep. And uh, maybe it didn't make it into the... You know, when I go live, it pulls 75 comments into the live stream software, and perhaps they didn't make it into the live stream software. I would consider that a blessing. <laughs> Maybe I will never see them. <laughs> uh, Jerry D says, morning, David. Dalton Blair's got some joy going on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you for the like. Much love to you. David Ray says, good morning, Diane Caldwell. Deborah says, Jerry, a sniper shot some bullets of poisonous words into the chat, aiming specifically at our sister, and then the sniper left. Wow. Wow. Cass says, my heart's fine, guys. Thanks for all the prayers and support. I am inoculated by the love of the Father. My identity is in Christ. Amen. Amen. May our identity be in Christ above all things. Amen. 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 Cat, I'm glad to hear that. Glad to hear you're fine, that you're inoculated by the love of the Father, your identity in Christ. Amen. Lars says, Diane, greetings, sister, and thank you for your continued prayers. Yes, my mom is a prayer warrior, for sure. Lars says, amen, Kat. Jerry says, Deb, I thought I was the only troll allowed here. <laughs> Jerry, you're not a troll, bro. You're not a troll. Deborah says, shalom, Diane Caldwell. Deborah says, haha, Jerry. All are welcome, and we let Jesus separate the trolls from the loving ones. Amen, amen, amen. Bro, let me let me just read this right here. Let me let me, this a sneak peek into today's New Testament reading. I'm just gonna read this. If anyone comes to your meeting and does not teach the truth about Christ, don't invite that person into your home or give any kind of encouragement. Anyone who encourages such people becomes a partner in their evil work. That is today's reading. We will read it again shortly. Uh, let's see, the living word. Rick says, what, Louise? Louise? Is it Louise? It's Louise, right? What Louise said, time will, time will tell I. Tell, time will tell I. 
Cass says, you are, Jerry. Don't worry. I won't let anyone take your position away. You are our official beloved troll. <laughs> Debra says, ha ha, troll Jerry. Iron, Ironhead Jerry. Cass says, that's beloved troll Debo Ray. Stacey Rose says, Brian, things have been a bit hectic over one year. Anniversary of my mom passing was yesterday. Oh, I'm so sorry, Stacey Rose. Sorry, I haven't been on point. Glad to catch you all this morning. Yes, we're so thankful as well. And uh, let's keep Stacey Rose in our thoughts and prayers. Amen. As Jack always says, let's keep each other in prayer. Uh, Lars says, prayers for Stacy. Deborah says, ha ha, beloved troll, Ironhead received of the Cast Iron Award. Jerry D, sound of applause. Hey, sound of applause. We got some, some celebration. Is that some applause? So, uh, Jerry says, Stacy Rose, sorry for your loss. I'll be praying for you to have some peace and relaxing moments. Amen. Thank you for the prayers, Jerry D. David Ray says, prayer, Stacy, with some peace and a rose. My beautiful sunshine bride, Miss Bobby Bell, has joined the live chat. Good morning, Bobby Bell. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Bobby says, good morning, Final Life family with lots of love. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Bobby Bell. Hope you made it safely and on time to work this morning. So good to see you and have you with us. Cass says, glad you're here. Stacy. find life, peace, joy, and encouragement with us. Amen, amen, and amen. Let's go. Let's go. Find peace, life, joy. Amen, amen. Stacey Rose says, inoculated by the love of the Father. I love it, Cat. Bobby Bell says, happy Friday. Good morning, Cat. David Ray says, good morning, Bobby Bell. With some peace. With a peace dove. Some coffee, a chocolate-covered donut. Some coffee and a rose. Beautiful, David Ray. Bobby Bell says, good morning, David Ray. Good morning, Stacy. Lars says, Bobby, Gonz- Bobby Gonzalez Bell. What, what, what? That's Bobby. Your car makes funny noises. Running hot. Running hot. Woo. I almost played it again. Deva says, uh, Bobby says, Bobby says, morning, Dale, with some love. Bobby Bell says, happy Friday, Lars and Mel. So good to see y'all. Deva says, Stacey Rose, those anniversaries are so hard. I'm so sorry. Amen. Uh, Thank you for the like. Much love to you. Melanie says, uh, Melanie says, she's sleepy. She's tired. She's, she looks a little fuzzy eyed and she's tired. Melanie, you can drift off to sleep. I know it's 1030 there for you. We wish you sweet and peaceful dreams. May you rest well and wake up and have a beautiful weekend, I pray, in the name of Jesus. Melanie, thank you for being here and bringing us some good word. You may you may rest off to sleep whenever you wish. Deborah says, the most beautiful, beloved, better half of Brian Bell, which is a blessed blessing, Bobby Bell. Cheering sound. Hey, that's right. We got it going on. Here's my song for Bobby Bell. Beautiful, beloved, better half, Brian Bell. Let's go, let's go. That's right, Deborah. I agree. Stacey Rose says, amen, Kat. Thank you. Thank you, David Ray. Jerry, Laura says, sweet dreams, sweet Melanie. Debra, Stacey, Stacey says, thank you, Debo. Debo, Ra. Stacey says, yes, I miss her. Mucho grande. Yes, I can imagine. Yes, yes, yes. I'm sorry. For, I am sorry for your loss, Stacey. And for the anniversary, I pray the Lord's Peace that surpasses all understanding be with you. May you feel the Lord's presence with you, I pray. Deb, Bobby says, oh, Deb, with a kiss. Cat says, first morning meow, first morning meow. Where's Hey, speaking of meow, where's Lamb been all week? Lammy, Lammy, we miss you. Anybody, anybody, anybody know anything about Lamb? Is our Lamb okay? Bobby Bell says, morning, Sarah, with some love. Deb says, we are never so old that it's easy to lose our mom or dad. Stacey Rose, amen. Bobby Bell says, good morning, Jerry. David says, I'm here. Had to feed the zoo animals, LOL. Stacey says, so very much. Thank you, guys. Love you all. May God's love, peace, me blessings reign on all of you and your families in Yeshua's name. Thank you, Stacey Rose. We pray the same for you. Jerry says, when you're on the farm all the time, every day is Friday. Hey, Jerry D, that's a blessing, bro. That's a blessing. Stacey says, no, I can't wait until the new heaven and earth. No more years, no more death. No more tears, no more death. Death will be defeated for good. Amen. Cass says, where are the zoo animals, David Ray? Say, Deborah says, amen, Stacy. all caps. What a glorious day that will be. David Ray says, hello, cat. Cats, possums, fish. <laughs> uh, oh, possums. Oh, possums. <laughs> hey, time for the word. Time for the word. Let's go. Let's see who else has joined in. Cat says, onward, Christian soldiers. That's right, Cat. Onward, Christian soldiers. Keep moving forward. Let's go. 
Vicki Calvert has joined in. Good morning, Vicki Calvert. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Hope you're having a great morning there on the East Coast. Vicki says, good morning, Finding Life family with some joy and some love. Happy Friday. So good to see everyone. Amen. What a blessing. What a privilege. What a blessing. Amen. Vicki Calvert, so good to see you. Stacey Rose says, LOL, cat. <laughs> cat and some fish. What's that fish doing? Looks like that, looks like that fish is being a dog. <laughs> All right. Let's... uh. Hey, there's Lamb right there. Speak of the angel. Lamb is here. Lamb says, okay, I'm finally here. Praise the Lord. Lamb, so good to see you and have you with us this morning. We've been missing you, girl. Glad you're glad you're still kicking. Glad you're still here. Praise God. So good to see you. Dalton says, Dalton Blair says, good morning all. God bless. God bless you, Dalton. It's so good to have you with us, bro. All right, let me scroll down. Let me, let me uh, take a break from the current reading of the live chat. And I will scroll down and see if I see anyone else that has joined in the live chat. Hey, if you're here with us this morning on the live stream, please be sure to say hello. We'd love to know that you are with us. And you can ask questions. You can leave comments. You can add your insight as we continue to seek wisdom, truth, and life. Amen. Let's go. Let's be, let's be thankful for this new day of life. And let's live it well. Amen. Let's honor God with our life. As we read this morning. Let's honor God. Digna has joined in, says, good morning, my dears. Good morning, Digna. So good to see you. Happy new day of life. So good to have you with us this morning. Hope you're doing well. Let's see. Anybody else? Dr. David Ray. Uh, Let's see here. Got the doctor in the house. Charles has joined in. Charles says, happy Friday from hot and humid Florida. Hope everybody's having a blessed day. You too, Charles. So good to see you and have you with us, bro. Hope you're enjoying your work. And we're so thankful that you could join in on the live stream. Oh, David Ray says, I deleted the comment that person posted. Get out of here. Thank you, David Ray. Bro, doing that good moderating. Thank you, bro. Protecting protecting us from the evil. God bless you. All right, let's see. Keep scrolling down. Vicky Calvert says, it sounds like we need each other in this chat. Oh, Vicky Calvert. Oh, Amen, girl. Vicky Calvert's down by. Let's go, let's go. Janice has joined in. Good morning, Janice. So good to see you and have you with us. Where's your Where's your partner, Lawanda? We, you and Lawanda always go hand in hand, I feel like, and we haven't seen Lawanda in forever either. Is Lawanda doing okay? We We hope so. Give us any updates on Lawanda if you if you if anybody has any. Janice says, "Cat, give it to God and let it go. Don't own it. Not your issue. What's the What's the phrase? Not my cir- Not my circus. Not my monkey. Not my circus. Something like that." Bobby Bill, Michelle, Janice says, Cat, give it to God and let it go. Don't own it, not your issue. Give grace always, anyway. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, God. Amen. Thank you, Janice. Janice, so good to see you. Happy new day of life. So good to have you with us this morning. Um, let's see. Let's see. Anybody else joined in? Thank you, Vicki Calvert. So I, I pray, I, I do too, and praise God. Let's continue to, as Jack always says, let's continue to pray for each other. Amen. We all need prayer. Full of Hope has joined in. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Where's it at? Full of Hope. Let's get you in here, girl. Full of Hope says, Happy Friday, Brian and Finding Life family. Happy Friday to you, Full of Hope. Hope you're having a good Friday there in beautiful Ireland. So good to have you with us. Uh, let's see here. Cass says, The Finding Life Christian Dance Club. Let's go. Uh, all right. John Mary is back. John Mary says, I'm back on air. Praise God. John Mary, so good to see you, bro. We need to get you a sound bite, don't we, bro? John Mary, back in the house. John Mary, so good to see you and have you with us. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a good Friday there in Uganda, bro. Much love to you. All right. Anybody else? Please forgive me if I miss you. I am scrolling quickly, and you guys have been doing a great job keeping the live chat alive and well. Uh, Bobby's got connections issues. Uh per use at work in the hospital. Uh, all right, all right. David Ray says, not my circus, not my monkeys, but I know the clowns. <laughs> all right, let me scroll back. I don't see anybody else. Please forgive me if I missed you. If you are here with us, so good to have you with us. Hey, if you're catching this on YouTube or the podcast after the live recording, we appreciate you being here and being a part of the Finding Life family as well. And we're on this journey of life together. Amen. Let's go. Praise God. Uh, let's, let's not... Con- let's not um, Let's continue to meet together and encourage one another. Amen. And all the more as we see the day approaching. 
All right, here we are. This is where we left off, right? This cat, this this fish sniffing something over here. All right, let's uh, let's take a break from the live chat. Six thirty-five on Friday, April 19, twenty twenty-four. A new day of life. Let us rejoice. Amen. This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad. Amen. Let's go. Let's find life. Hey, by the way, Proverbs says in eight thirty-five, we're seeking wisdom, truth, and life. Proverbs says in 835, wisdom says, wisdom says in Proverbs 835, whoever finds me finds life. Matthew 7, 14 says, small is the gate and narrow the path that leads to life and only a few find it. How sad is that? We already said Isaiah 55, 3. We already said Proverbs 21, 21. Let's say a prayer. Heavenly Father, God, thank you so much for this new day of life. God, thank you that you are always with us and bigger than anything we face. Thank you for this family, God. Thank you for this privilege to come together. No matter where we are in the world, no matter what time zone we're in, that we can come together right here, right now, and seek you and read your word and hear from you and pray for one another and encourage one another, God. Thank you. What an honor and a privilege to come together as one and seek you, Lord. God, we seek you with all our heart, mind, and soul. God, thank you that we have access to your living word, the light to our path. God, help us to know you more. Help us to just not hear your word, but to live it out. Help us to take action. Help us not to squander the gifts that you give us. God, may we do well with what you have given us. May we honor you with our life. May we may we shine your light, I pray and love, and spirit, and truth. God, I pray that we we hear from you through your word this morning, God. Help us to hear what you want us to hear, and see what you want us to see, and understand what you want us to understand. Thank you for this time together. Thank you for your word. Thank you that you're always with us. God, we pray for Israel. We pray your will be done in Israel. God, I pray for everyone here. I pray for er everyone who's hearing my voice. God, I pray that they would feel your presence. I pray for healing. I pray for peace, your peace, God, the only peace that surpasses all understanding. God, I pray for the fullness of your spirit, your joy, your love, your peace, your patience, your kindness, your gentleness, your goodness, your faithfulness, your power, your victory, God, your self-control. God, may your spirit fill us overflow in us and be evident to everyone around us, God. May it be evident that we belong to you. May we shine your light. Thank you for this time. God, we love you. We praise you. We seek you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. All right, let's go. Hey, we're going to we're gonna read the, we're going to start 2 John today, and we're going to read the entire book. All right? We might just be here all day. We'll see. All right, let's get into it. Let's get into the word. Hey, we're doing a a short reading actually here every morning, Monday through Friday, 6 a.m. Pacific, to start our day in the best way possible with some encouragement, some good, encouraging, joy-filled community because life is hard and we need each other. And the wisdom, truth, and life, the source of wisdom, truth, and life, the living word, the light to our path. There's nothing more important than the word of the Lord, the word that became flesh and made his dwelling among us and went to the cross and gave his life for us, the living word. Let's get into it. Today's New Testament. We're going to read the entire book of 2 John. (laughs) Let's go. 2 John. By the way, let me just read a little intro here. A little little intro from from the Life Application Study Bible. If I can get a hold of it, it's a big one. It's a big one. The purpose of this book, to emphasize the basics of following Christ, truth and love, to warn against false teachers. It was written by the Apostle John. It says, to the, quote, chosen lady, not really sure who the chosen lady is, and her children, or possibly to a local church and all believers everywhere. It was written about the same time as 1 John, around A.D. 90 from Ephesus. It says the setting, evidently this woman and her family were involved in one of the churches that John was overseeing. They had developed a strong relationship with John. 
John was warning her of the false teachers who were becoming prevalent in some of the churches. The key verse of this book says, And this is love, that we walk in obedience to his commands. As you have heard from the beginning, his command is that you walk in love. All right, let's read it. Let's read it. The word of the Lord, 2 John chapter 1, or 2 John, the entire book. (laughs) This letter is from John the Elder. I am writing to the chosen lady and to her children, whom I love in the truth, as does everyone else who knows the truth, because the truth lives in us and will be with us forever. Praise God. The truth lives in us and will be with us forever. Grace, mercy, and peace, which come from God the Father and from Jesus Christ, the Son of the Father, will continue to be with us who live in truth and love. How happy I was to meet some of your children and find them living according to the truth, just as the Father commanded. I am writing to remind you, dear friends, that we should love one another. John wants to remind us that we should love one another. This is not a new commandment, but one we have had from the beginning. Love love means doing what God has commanded us, and he has commanded us to love one another, just as you heard from the beginning. I say this because many deceivers have gone out into the world. They deny that Jesus Christ came in a real body the deceivers. Such a person is a deceiver and an antichrist. Watch out that you do not lose what we have worked so hard to achieve. Be diligent so that you receive your full reward. Anyone who wanders away from this teaching has no relationship with God. Anyone who wanders away from this teaching has no relationship with God. But anyone who remains In the teaching of Christ, this right here, anyone who remains in the teaching of Christ has a relationship with both the Father and the Son. If anyone comes to your meeting and does not teach the truth about Christ, don't invite that person into your home or give any kind of encouragement. Anyone who encourages such people becomes a partner in their evil work. I have much more to say to you, but I don't want to do it with paper and ink, for I hope to visit you soon and talk with you face to face. Then our joy will be complete. Greetings from the children of your sister chosen by God. And that is the book of 2 John. All right, let me know if you have any thoughts, comments, insights, anything you want to share. Today's psalm is chapter 125, verses 1 through 5. A pretty short reading today, which is good because we are short on time. I need to close out at 7 today. Uh, Psalm 125, 1 through 5. Those who trust in the Lord are as secure as Mount Zion. Those who trust in the Lord are as secure as Mount Zion. They will not be defeated, but will endure forever. Those who trust in the Lord will not be defeated but will endure forever. Just as the mountains surround Jerusalem, so the Lord surrounds his people. The Lord surrounds his people both now and forever. The wicked will not rule the land of the godly, for then the godly might be tempted to do wrong. O Lord, do good to those who are good, whose hearts are in tune with you. O Lord, do good to those who are good, whose hearts are in tune with you. But banish those who turn to crooked ways, O Lord. Take them away with those who do evil. May Israel have peace. May Israel have peace. That is today's psalm, chapter 125, verses 1 through 5. Today's Proverbs, chapter 29, verses 9 through 11. If a wise person takes a fool to court, There will be ranting and ridicule, but no satisfaction. The bloodthirsty hate blameless people, but the upright seek to help them. Fools vent their anger. Here's the one on anger. 
Dalton, and I thought about your James 119 verse when I read this last night. Fools vent their anger, but the wise quietly hold it back. Proverbs 29, 11. Fools vent their anger, but the wise quietly hold it back. All right, that is today's word, the word of the Lord, the living word, the light to our path. May we not just hear it, may we live it out. Amen. May we live the truth. May we not just hear the word, may we live it out. May we shine the light of the Lord. Amen. All glory to God. All right, let me know if you have any thoughts, comments, insight, anything you want to share. I'll get back to a live chat for the last 15 minutes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's, Laura says, Vicky, good to, so good to see you, sister. Deborah says, Vicky, shalom. Been missing you this morning. David Ray says, good morning, Vicky Calvert. Saints Rose says, amen, Deborah. Glorious indeed. Lammy, so good to see you, Lammy. <laughs> We've been missing you. Dalton, so good to have you with us, bro. So good to have you with us, bro. God bless you. Lamb says, had trouble getting on here. Eek. There says, Lamb, love, hugs to, hugs and love to you. Jerry says, next time a troll pops in, please let them know the position is filled by me. All right. Jerry, you are, if you are a troll, you a good troll, bro. You a good purple troll. We love you, bro. We're so glad you're here. Deborah says, why did you have trouble, Lamb? Laura says, onward, onward and upwards, cat. That's what I said this morning in my, in my post. Upward and onward. Let's go. Up and go. Let's go. Up. Lamb says, thanks, Dev. I've missed you guys. We missed you too, Lammy. Deborah says, ha ha, Jerry D. We will do that. The position is filled. Sorry. There is no opening here. <laughs> Stacey says, onward, onward we must go, cat. Rick says, heads up. Going to be a smoky summer this year as we will be running from forest fires. Prayers are needed. All right. Stacey's Rose says, yes, and upward. Lamb says, I don't know. I couldn't find the channel on YouTube. What? What? Bobby Bell says, good morning, Lamb, with lots of love. So good to see you. Bobby Bell says, morning, Brian, with some love and a kiss. Oh, thank you, babe. Morning to you and love and kiss to you. Thank you so much, babe. So really appreciate that. Laura says, hi, Lamb. Didn't see you before. Greeting, sister. Lamb says, all caps, Bobby. Cat says, yay, morning lamb and Vicky Chick. Let's go. Vicky Chick. Rick says, never seen it this dry before. Yikes. Lamb says, Lars, I just got here. Stacey says, sounds like I might have, I may have had some typos. No worries, no worries. Lars is blowing a kiss to Cat and Lamb. <laughs> lamb says, hey, Miss Cat, meow. Cat says, we'll do, Jerry. Your position is secure with a strong arm. Rick, uh, Jerry says, too bad Brian doesn't have a Saturday show. Bay City Rollers don't get the sound bites. Hmm. Bay City, Bay City, Bay City Rollers don't get the sound bites. Uh, what does that mean? <laughs> I'm not sure what that means, bro. <laughs> uh, thank you, Jerry. Say so says good morning and blessings, Lamb. Rick says already prepping RV and trailers. Oh, for the forest fires. Cat says, Lamb, did you get my link? I sent you. Vicky says good morning, Deb, David, Ray, Cat, and Lamb. Lamb says I'm at another appointment, so in a minute. I'll be gone again, but I love you all. I'll be here when my life slows down a little. All right, Lammy. It's so good to have you with us for a few minutes. And let's keep Lamb in our thoughts and prayers. And uh, Lamb, we, we look forward to seeing you back soon, Lord willing. Lars says, yes, Jerry, let's vote about it. Brian, on the, so on the show Saturday, vote one. <laughs> hey, thank you, guys. I'm so, I'm so honored that you want to see me more than five days a week. Man, that is a blessing, and it blesses my heart. Thank you so much. Much love to you all, I promise. Man, thank you. Lamb says, Cat, I did. Thanks. Vicky says, work, listening, and working. Okay, Vicky, I hope we're nice to your ears. Deborah says, Cat is Father Cat is Father God's favorite daughter. No way would I be mean to his favorite daughter. Excellent. Cat says, quick, Brian, lamb, a lamb-cat soundbite combo. Please. You got it, girl. A lamb-cat. <laughs> there you go. Says Rose says, Amen. Digna says, Good morning, my dears. Good morning to you, Digna. So good to see you and have you with us. Laura says, Good morning, dear Digna. So good to see you, sister. Says Rose says, Good morning, Dalton. Blessings. Lamb says, Would y'all please pray for something? I've lost one of my hearing aids. I really need it. All right, let's pray right now. Join me in prayer. Heavenly Father God, we just pause right now to pray for Lamb, God, that she would be able to find her hearing aid. God, we know that you are above all, that you are all knowing, all powerful. You're able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine. And God, we know that you know where Lamb's hearing aid, hearing aid is, and we just pray, God, that, it, that it, it would be found. We just pray, God, that you would help Lamb find her hearing aid. We know that with you all things are possible, 
And we know, God, that you have the knowledge and the power. And we know, God, that you help us in times of need. And we thank you that you are always with us. And, God, we just pray right now that you would help Lamb find her hearing aid, God. Guide her to it, I pray. Make it evident to her. Make her, maybe rem- rem- give her a memory of something or or a hint or a clue or just make it evident or someone in her family find it, God. We just pray that whatever the way, God, that Lamb would be able to be reunited with her hearing aid today. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. All right. Lamb, we'll keep you in thought and prayer, as always. Stacey Rose says, Dr. David Ray. Dalton Blair says, good morning, Stacey. Dennis says, good morning, Lars. Stacey Rose says, come on, hot. <laughs> oh, yeah. Coming in hot. Deborah says, I'll pray for your hearing aid to show itself, Lamb. Stacey Rose says, okay, no more typing for me. I can't do it right. Charles, good to see you, bro. David Ray, thank you, bro. Laura says, Stacy, no worries. I certainly can't. Yeah. Coming in hot. Stacy Rose is giving some love. Jerry D says, must have been a green hair troll. Definitely not a purple hair troll. <laughs> we only have one. Jerry, I don't even like calling you a troll, bro. But if we ha- if we only have one, it's definitely, you you're, you have it, bro. You have it. You have it. Uh, David Ray says, good morning, Charles. Laura says, thanks, David. I was paralyzed for a moment. Cat says, the more I would try to, the more I would try to love and help my mother, the more she would attack and falsely accuse me. I've had this spirit of false accusation on from my childhood. I go around scared and paranoid. Cat, just give that to the Lord, girl. Let's keep Cat in our thoughts and prayers. Lars says, LOL, Jerry. David Ray says, I got y'all's back, LOL. Let's go. Cat says, pray that I can overcome and break the spirit off, off, off my life. Heavenly Father, God, just pray for Cat, God, that you would fill her with her spirit and cleanse her of any darkness, God. Please be with Cat, Lord. Please cleanse her, heal her, and use her in a powerful way, God, to shine your light. God, I just pray that you fill Cat, that you overflow her with your spirit of light, God, because there is no dark in there is no darkness in light. May cats, may cat be filled with your light, Lord. I pray with the fullness of your spirit, Lord. I pray. May she overflow with your spirit and shine your light. I pray. God, cleanse her, heal her, and use her, Lord. I pray. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Let's keep praying for each other. Laura says, amen, Kat. I know the situation. Stacey says, my cousin married a guy named Dalton. So I have a cousin named Dalton now. And it's not you, right? (laughs) We have a Dalton here with us, too, in Southern California. In person, yes, we do. So we got a few Daltons going around. Let's go. Laura says, grew up like that. Stacey Rose says, thank you all with some love. Laura says, sounds like we need need each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did it earlier, right? We sure do. We sure do. Sarah says, prayers prayers for you, cat. Jenna says, cat, give it to God and let it go. Don't own it. Not your issue. Give grace always. Anyway, in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, God. Amen, Janice. All right. Amen. Amen. We need each other. Some love to Janice. Cat says, you forgot to do the O-O, Lars. Very important. <laughs> Vicky says, I pray for everyone here daily. Thank you, Vicky Calvert. We so greatly appreciate that. Full of hope. So good to see you and have you with us. Jerry says, good morning. Lars says, uh-oh. Where is it at? Uh-oh. I got so many uh, sound bites now. I got to like go to so many different screens. Cat says, the Finding Life Christian Dance Club. Vicky says, good morning, full of hopes. Good to see you. Jerry says, fish fry tonight at my place. Willie is the grill master. Man, let's go. Let's go, Jerry. Man, I so wish we could all come to your place tonight, bro. That would be so awesome. Laura says, my keyboard changed to Danish. Struggling here. Sarah says, morning, BB. That's Bobby Bell. John Mary says, I'm back on the air. Let's go, John Mary. So good to have you with us, bro. Janice says, Shalom, Lars and Melanie. May your thoughts of each other always be to build the other and actions prove your love. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, God. Amen, Janice. All right. Bobby Bell says, hugs, cat, with lots of love. So glad you're inoculated. Let's go. Full of hope says, Jerry, Lars, Vicky, cat, Stacy Rose, Sarah Charles, David Ray, Digna Lamb, and the beautiful Bobby Bell. Let's go. Full of hope. John Mary, cat's got some rainbows for you. Good reminder of the flood. Amen. Vicar says, beautiful Janice. Grateful for Lars and Melanie. All right. All right. Bobby Bell says, good morning, Janice. God bless you with this beautiful day. Good morning, Vicky. All right. Let's see. Let's see if we can get, let's see if we can get a little more caught up in this live chat. Bobby Bell says, good morning, John Mary, with some love. Lars says, a very talented John Mary. So good to see you, bro. John Mary says, Cat, good to see you. All right. Lots of, lots of good greetings here. Cat says, thanks, Bobby. Hi, Pola. Are you full of hope today? Every day. Every day, Paolo is full of hope. 
Jenna says, yes, Vicky, hope your day is easy, smooth, and each obstacle be clear in its solution every time. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, God. Amen. Thank you, Janice. Vicky Howard says, thank you, Bobby. So good to see you. Laura says, now I'm going to the fridge, cat. Cheese. John Murray says, Bobby, thanks for my connection. Had failed, but finally I'm here with wow. Let's go. Dara says, blessings, John Murray. Cat says, Lars, laughter, lots of laughter. <laughs> Deb says, shalom, Janice. John Murray says, Lars, really thanks. Bobby Bell says, I often have a connection problem as well, John Murray. Glad you're here. Full of Hope says, Cat, yes, my hope is renewed every morning. All glory to God. Amen. What is it? What is it? Uh, joy, but joy comes in the morning. Uh, what is it? Something. Let's type it in. But joy comes in the morning. Let's, what's the actual wording? Psalm 30, Psalm 30, 45. Oh, I dropped. I typed in "hun" instead of "hub." <laughs> Psalm thirty-five. Weeping may weeping may stay for the night, but rejoicing comes in the morning. Amen. Weeping may come. Weeping may stay for the night, but rejoicing comes in the morning. Weeping may last through the night, but joy comes with the morning. Amen. Let's go. It's a new day. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. Let's go. Fresh slate. Bobby Bell says, happy day, full of hope with some love. Cass says, thanks, big bro, David Ray. Deborah says, Paola, full of hope. There is another of Father God's favorite daughters in the chat. Honored to be here with you, Paola. John Mary says, Deborah, blessings to you, my beloved friend. John Mary says, Lars, I hope I was in Denmark. I would be the best athlete there. Woo! John Mary coming in hot. What? Coming in hot. Deborah says, always an honor to be with the favorite children of God, like Paola. Full of hope says, oh, my dear sister Deborah, I love you. God bless you. Vicky Coward says, thank you, Janice. Deborah says, woohoo, jig. Cat says, not my monkey, not my circus. Never heard of that, but I'm certainly going to use it. <laughs> David Ray, all caps, not my circus, not my monkeys, but I know the clowns. <laughs> uh, Janice says, good morning, Bobby. You looked fabulous in your in your purr outfit. May you get selected and win next time. Oh, your T-P-I-R. Your T-P-I-R outfit. May you get selected and win next time. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, God. Thank you, Janice. We are planning to go back soon. Bobby's sister, Dana, is moving here in a few weeks, moving here with her job. And uh, we're planning to go back when Dana gets here. So we'll go We'll go try again. We'll go try again. John Mary says, Bobby, yes, it's always hard for our our guard gets are very weak to hold strong connection. Yeah, next. We got you, girl. Cass says, ha-ha, David, not the clowns. Not the clowns. Deborah says, ha-ha, David, I promise I won't comment on that clown statement. Oh, it's so hard. <laughs> oh, let's see. Sage Rose says, should I share the link to my to Find a Life on my Facebook? Heck yes, girl. Heck yes. Share the love. Share the love. Yes, Stacey Rose. Boho says, pray for Israel this weekend. Amen. And that's what Jack would say. I'm missing Jack today. John Murray says, I'm so, so annoyed about our government for overcharging us while buying data connection. Mm. We, John Murray, we overcharge here in California too, bro. David Ray says, yes, Deb, definitely. Janice says, my grace I give to you. That's enough for me. Thank you, God. Amen, Janice. David Ray says, Stacy, yes, please. Yes. Stacy says, okay, cool. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Bobby Bell says, good morning, Dalton. With some love, God, continue to wrap you up and bring you joy and peace, Dalton. Dalton, prayer from Bobby Bell. Good morning. With some love, God, continue to wrap you up and bring you joy and peace. Amen. Jerry says, I wish I knew how to share links. Took me about an hour to figure out how to send pics in an email. <laughs> you did a great job, Jerry. You did a great job. Bobby Bell says, well, good morning, Digna. John Mary says, hello, Vicky. Cat says, Lars, Lars, still eating cheese. Hey, it's almost time to close out. Let's uh, thank you, God, for the amens, for joining me in the prayer. Deborah says, all day sounds good. Let's go. Let's go. And uh, yeah, I hope you'll be back in time to dance too, Debo. David Ray says, Psalm 91, 14 through 16. Let's go check that out. Let's go, David Ray. Got some word. Psalm 91, 14 through 16. From David Ray, because he loves me, says the Lord, I will rescue him. I will protect him, for he acknowledges my name. He will call on me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With long life, I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. Praise God. Thank you, David Ray. Good word, bro. Praise God. He is always with us. Amen. All right, all right. 
Jerry says, I would like to thank my two shepherds, Brian and Hilly, for caring and loving us and bringing the word daily. Mm. Thank you, Jerry D. It is our privilege and honor, I promise you. I promise you, bro. Cass says, Jerry, you would see a link symbol somewhere. Click on that. You can send a link. All right, all right, all right. The importance of commas. <laughs> uh, John Mary says, Vicky, I'm so glad to see you today. John Mary says, amen, Brian. May the word of God be fruitful in our lives. Amen. Amen. Jerry, you didn't look short, bro. Full of Hope says, wow, it's like Brian chose today's scripture just for me. I needed to hear that. A, it wasn't me, Full of Hope, I promise. It's the living word. Amen. It's the living word, alive and active, sharper than any double-edged sword. I promise you it's not me. It's the living word. Genesis says, love, all caps, with truth. No excuses, but forgiveness is freedom to love. Amen. Let's go. Genesis says, may, your, may our hearts always be in tune with God forevermore. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, God. Amen. Janice. Janice, we might be coming up towards your way end of the month. We're heading up to the Seattle area to visit some. I'm going to reunite with some Air Force buddies that I haven't seen in like 28 years. And it's just a weekend trip, though. We're just we're flying up on Friday night and flying back on Sunday. Quick, quick weekend trip to see some old, some good old military friends. Almost like at least 28 years since I've seen these guys. And so uh, be up in the Seattle area. I think you're up that way, Janice. I could be wrong. Full of hope. John Mary says, full of hope. Yes, we live in Trinity. Cat says, after this, Gabriel and I are going to a celebration of life service for the church widow who died in the hospital. I had been visiting and helping her the past few months. Oh, well, let's let's do that, Cat. Celebrate the life. Amen. Jerry says, Janice, my biggest hang up, my flesh loves to rebel. Yes, we all have that, Jerry. We all have that. Prone to wander, Lord, I feel it. Yes, indeed. Dalton Blair says, Shalom. Stacey says, Praise Jesus. Laura says, Catherine and Gabriel, condolences. Rick said, I told two people today to control their emotions yesterday. Uh, my daughter requested we wear bright spring colors. Rick says, Good words, Brian. All glory to God. John Murray says, Janice, yes, that's true. His name should be rifted and exalted forever. Full Hope says, Thank you, Brian. I wrestled with anger and revenge for hours last night, but I stayed quiet even though I was presented with an opportunity to get revenge. I rebuked. Praise God. Uh, all right. Hey, we got to close out. I got to go get Jaden up and ready for school and get to work. I got to be at work earlier than normal today. And, uh, and so I much love to you all. So thankful for our time together. Hey, we'll plan to do this again on Monday, Lord willing. And, uh, let's see, Haley's got his show tomorrow. We have Echo Church, the church that we moved here to Southern California to help start in 2019. We'll be in person there on Sunday. If you're ever in the local area here in Southern California, Come, come find life with us in person. We'd love to have you. Details are in the description of the video. I'm going to scroll down to the bottom of the live chat. Sorry I can't get all your comments in here, but I so greatly appreciate you keeping uh, the live chat alive and well. Like I said, much love to you all. I love and appreciate you. Regina joined in. Good morning, late. Good morning, Regina. So good to see you and have you with us this morning. Vicky says, praying for blessings upon each person in this chat group. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Lord. I love you all. Have a wonderful weekend. Keep trusting in the Lord. Amen, Vicky. Good word. Thank you for that, Vicky. Thank you for your prayers. Thank you for your prayers. Amen. Rick, uh, Rick says, everything we feel is in the book of our Father. Our Father loves us. Amen. 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 Weeping may endure for the night, but joy comes in the morning. Amen. It is morning. For us, it is, huh? Not for you, Melanie. I'm sorry. <laughs> or or uh, Paola. Or, or uh, Lars. <laughs> sorry, y'all. Or John Mary. Sebastian joined in. Sebastian, so good to see you back. So good to see you back, Sebastian. So good to see you, bro. Happy new day of life. Hope you have a great weekend, Sebastian. Good to see you and have you with us this morning. Much love to you all. What's Dalton got for us there? Can't tell. Can't tell what that is. Uh, let's see. Dalton says, all right, I got to go. God bless you all. God bless you, Dalton. Hope you have a great day and weekend. And uh, yes, the cast says, bye, Dalton. Thanks for sharing life with us. Amen. All right, all right. Full of Hope says, leave a comment after the live, please. Thank you, Full of Hope. I appreciate that. Let's, uh, you know, let's make him known. Amen. Let's shine his light and make him known. We need, everyone needs a relationship with their creator, whether they know it or not. Amen. And so let's shine his light. Let's make him known. Let's look people in the eye and give them a smile. Everybody's going through something. Let's share the light and the love of the Lord. Amen. Let's live life well. Let's honor, let's strive to honor God with our life, to bring him glory, to do good work to be the hands and feet of Jesus. Amen. And uh, let's go. Uh, let's go. Uh, 
Lars says, Dalton, if Brian forgot your question from yesterday, you can send it on his website. God bless you, brother. Thank you, Lars. Yes, amen. Amen. Yes, if you want to send me a message, you can go to my website, sbrianbell.com. Everything is sbrianbell. Everything is sbrianbell. You can go to sbrianbell.com. You can send me a message there. You sure can. You sure can. Jerry says, Seattle, you'll be passing me on I-5. Stop if you like. Hey, we're flying in. We're flying into Seattle. And uh, but, but we're going up to uh, Kamano Island. Never even heard of it. Uh, Kamano Island is where uh, they ha- they have a big Airbnb for for everyone, and so we'll be there. Just a quick trip for the for the weekend. Uh, all right, all right. Let's see here. I'm gonna scroll down to the bottom to the bottom of the live chat. Regina says blessings to every person. And uh, what time driving by? Oh, the purple dinosaur waving. Oh man, that would be awesome, Jerry. We're we're gonna be landing in Seattle around 10 o'clock Friday night, the last weekend of the month, and then we'll be driving from Seattle to Kamano Island. Uh, probably from like 11 to 12 is what I'm expecting. Uh, somewhere in that time frame. It'll be dark. And Sunday, we're flying back. Uh, we fly we fly back Sunday. We'll be driving back to Seattle probably around 4.30 or 5. Uh, Jerry, well, keep in touch. Keep in touch, bro. And uh, through the email, see if we can see if we can catch you. Uh, on this, see if we can like connect for a second. That would be awesome. That would be awesome. All right. Hey, much love to you all. Get your dancing shoes on. It's time to close out. Hope you guys have a great day or night, depending on where you are in the world. So thankful for you. And uh, we'll plan to do this again on Monday, Lord willing. Yeah, get those shoes on. It's time. It's time. It's time. All right. Love you guys. Thanks for being here. I appreciate all your love and support. Let's continue to find life together. Amen. Let's continue to meet together, encourage one another, pray for one another, and live life well. We're on this journey of life together. Let's live it well and honor God. We'll plan to see you back Monday, Lord willing. Until then, keep aiming up. Eyes on Christ. Eyes on Christ. You can walk on water. Keep aiming up. Keep finding life. We'll plan to see you Monday. Until then, bye, Uncle Niels. Hey, friend. Thanks for watching my video or listening to my podcast. Again, I'm so glad you're here. If you would like more information about Finding Life, please be sure to subscribe. Don't forget about my free PDF download, The Top 3 Keys to Finding Life, which also includes the one decision that completely changed everything for me and can for you too. I'll have a link to it below. If you would like to help me help others find life, please be sure to give me a like, leave me a comment, a review, share with your family and friends. Any activity I get helps me help others find life. Lastly, don't forget to let me know how I can help you. What challenges are you facing? What are you struggling with? Let me know how I can help you specifically. Leave me a comment, send me an email, or set up a call with me. Until next time, let me leave you with this. There is a common thread that connects us all, and there is more to life than meets the eye. If you have ever felt like there has to be something more to life, you're on the right track. Keep moving forward. Yeah.